going on guys all right this morning we're home at the homestead so we got to get the mule here he's been sitting here so long tires flat got to get all this cleaned out probably get the battery charged up uh, chase is bringing the equipment down we're gonna get it ready to go uh, we're actually supposed to go mow a yard, so I got a call on it. We're gonna go mow it, I guess, if we can hold that rain there off. But anyways, uh, yeah, we got to go look at a yard too, as far as uh, leaf cleanup. So we're gonna we're gonna be doing lawn care today. So uh, you guys, just hang on for the ride. All right, Chase is here. What up? Look, it still looks the same. The whole setup. <laughs> Nasty and <laughs> Nasty and <Spin> up. <laughs> I like I think we literally just mowed the last cut and just threw it in the barn. <laughs> That's what I did. Somebody got stuck. I didn't get stuck. Is it the the tires got mud on them too? It's just <laughs> not good to feel Well, rain. it's raining. So, I'm airing the tire up on the truck, on the lawn care truck. So, got this little slime, you know, anything. It takes a while, but it works. So, it was completely flat. You guys seen that earlier. So, oh, now it's raining. Hopefully, uh, it won't rain tomorrow. We'll knock that yard out. If I can get Luke over here. <laughs> I gotta go look at that yard, that leaf leaf cleanup yard. What's it? Whitney's over yonder? Yeah. Yeah. Is where a handheld is really not going to perform very well with you I mean you can get it done there's no doubt about that but a good backpack blower will clean all this off now it's raining I'm wet you know but that's where you're going to need it to blow really good to get all this stuff off so but there's the finished product actually let me come this way didn't we just strike it that way you still see some of our stripes in it from last year. But uh, there's the stripes and stuff. We really just wanted to get it cleaned up. Get the ditch all clean. Now I'll come back and spray these rocks out. That way the ditch stays clean. But, uh, well, reached out to Luke today. Haven't heard nothing from him. See, that's the only thing that I'm afraid of because we don't have, we don't have the time I mean, we do. We can get the stuff done that I have right now, that me and Chase have, when we come home. But the problem is, is this stuff's probably going to get out of hand. You see what I'm saying? Now, unless we mow, like, super short, you know, but I'm not going to be able to grow it because, you know, when people call you, let's just say we leave out tomorrow. Well, if somebody calls me wanting an estimate done, I don't have anybody to send out to, to give them a bid or anything like that. That's why it's so important that Luke answers his phone and does everything that needs to be done. Because as we grow, the more money Luke will make. Because I'm going to put him on a percentage because we have... We've got plenty of work to keep him busy, but not enough work to really pay him by the hour. So, <clears throat> because if we pay him by the hour, he's only gonna work a couple days. So, I mean, he's not gonna be making anything. So in order to at least get him to where he's making, you know, three, $400 a week, 
we're going to have to put him on a percentage. So basically like a commission type deal. So, and the more money or, and the more yards we pick up, the more money he'll make. So hopefully that will motivate him to keep this going. So anyways, uh, Chase is wrapping up. I need to get busy and get this, uh, get this stuff blown off. All right, guys, so I don't know if you guys could hear me. So now Chase couldn't get the mower loaded because we are sitting on a hill. So what you'll have to do is you either have to go up and turn around and come back down or get the truck down to where it's a little more level. So he didn't go down far enough. might be able to get it there so, but like I said it was uh that's a really hard pretty hard incline there let's see if we can get it up there now the trailers a little more uh, it is a little more level there so he might be able to get it let's see Raise the deck. What? Hell, dude, the trailer's sitting like that. All right, guys, we couldn't get it up on there. So basically, what I did was is I cranked up on this to get the trailer. For whatever reason, it was sitting like that. I know what happened. He's got that big drop hitch on there. We had the other one on there that's flipped upside down. Cause he's got it on there for his uh, his other trailer. So, anyways, continue on. Me and Chase are in a pickle that I've never been in before. So last week while we were on the road, I got a call from a lady because I've been po pushing uh, Facebook and that Norwood app thing. Guys, you can pick up some yards on that on the app, the neighborhood app. Uh, but anyways, I got a call from her and so I told her, you know, when we get back in town, we'll come look at the yard. She said, that's fine. So we come out to look at it and... Uh, this is one of my good friend Adam's yards. So, you know, when we pulled up, because I felt, I told Chase, I was like, I feel like we're going to one of Adam Ezell's yards like that, because, you know, I've mowed this yard, you know, a few times for him. And uh, sure enough, we come pulling up, and that's his yard. So I called him, you know, because I'm not going to do him like that. And I'm going to let her know that, you know, that it's one of my friend's yards and I'm not gonna you know not gonna take his yard away from him so anyways guys comment below if you've had this happen before uh first time I've ever had that happen so the hill right there that is good yeah all right guys we're gonna head over here to this other client's house she says she had a boatload of leaves in the backyard so we're gonna see what we got to do that's probably going to end up being for luke so go up and around dude but it's probably going to end up being for luke so if he'll answer me back well got to fix the truck too so <laughs> anyways uh you know you turned wrong word you, know this one, you can yeah but anyways uh when we get over here all right guys here's what they're talking about so chase went and got the mower we're going to try to mulch it up guys we're 
give up on the idea of mulching them up. Uh, it's just too wet right now. So, we're just gonna wait. Hopefully it'll dry out enough and we'll get them next time we come back. They've obviously been laying there for quite some time. So, we're just gonna go ahead and wait. Uh, watch if we probably can't get it up on there. Oh, there he goes. All right, so, like I said, we're gonna wait and see what happens, but uh, yeah. That's it. So that's gonna be it for the day on the lawn care video. Uh, you know, we only had that one yard to cut and then she wanted us to come over here and check this one out. So uh, like I said, we'll just get them leaves dried up and uh, the ferris will mulch that stuff right up. No problem, but the problem is, is it's so wet, it's just clogging up in the deck and we can't get a equal throw of leaves out the side of the discharge so we're just gonna wait uh and uh come back next time we come in town uh and get it done so anyways guys i hope you enjoyed the video of this uh this lawn care video first one of the year what are you looking at are you looking at me oh it looked like you was looking on the back porch but anyways hope you enjoyed the video comment rate subscribe and as always Keep mowing. Never stop. <laughs>